Now you got me on a love ride Now you got me on a love ride Jumping off the porch like mom's not home Tell me why the best things feel so wrong Summer nights, love them how they take so long well, it is uh, finals week here at Yale, and uh, kind of sucks. If you've been wondering why I haven't been posting, uh, there's your answer. It hasn't all been bad, though. Uh, I'll give you guys a little bit of an update. This past weekend was really fun. We actually got our first snow of the season, and there were Christmas parties and gift exchanges and all of that holiday stuff, you know, that you want to get out of the way before you get smacked in the face with finals. So this past Monday through Thursday is what we consider reading week here at Yale which is um, four days, I guess. It's not really a week, it's more like four days. But it is before finals, but after classes have finished. So it's a time period that can be dedicated solely to studying for finals. Come Monday morning, it was like a dark shroud was just dropped on campus. You know, all the libraries and classrooms and uh, common spaces that used to be like bustling with like conversations and excitement were now all dead. And I mean, there's people studying everywhere. Like even down in the buttery, when uh, me and a couple of my sweet mates might go down and play ping pong, there's people studying there at the table. You know, everyone's super stressed, everyone's super busy studying. It's a lot different of an atmosphere than I'm used to. Personally, I spent most of this week prepping for my math exam. I actually already took multivariable calculus in high school, you guys may have known that, but uh, Yale actually didn't accept that credit, but that's a whole other story on its own. But when I took it in high school, my teacher actually left off like the last half of like the last unit. I didn't think it was a big deal then, but it turns out that that whole last unit is pretty much most of the semester in multivariable calculus. It's like all the vector calculus stuff, if you guys are familiar with that. And it is pretty difficult and pretty time consuming. So I've been kind of reviewing all the theorems and concepts and making sure I know how to connect everything and how to solve a wide range of problems. For the final, which was actually today, which is uh, Saturday. I actually just got back from the final. Um, it went it went pretty well. It was it was long though. I had to wake up early. It was from 9 a.m. to 12:30. So uh, just got back, had lunch, and now I'm just uh, chilling in the room. I'd have to say it was pretty successful. Um, considering on some of the practice exams, I didn't know how to approach some of the questions. I answered everything on the test and felt pretty confident about my answers. Um, Probably any points that I lose are due to the stupid mistakes that I always manage to make. I'm sure you guys are familiar with that, especially in math classes. Hopefully I'm in the uh, the A range and that'll help boost up my, my midterm grade, which was a little subpar. You know, I get back, I want to relax, but I can't because I have a physics final on Monday and I haven't really started studying yet because I've been studying for math all week long because I felt that was more important. So um, yeah, these are gonna be a busy two and a half days. But overall, I just wanted to check in with you guys and let you guys in on what finals are like at Yale and what they're like at college in general, because I'm sure you guys are curious. It's nice this semester because math and physics are actually my only two finals, because for English, I had a paper that I turned in last night. And then for computer science, I had a final project, which uh, was the uh, weather application you probably saw me working on in the Day in the Life video, if you saw that. If you haven't, go check it out, by the way. It's one of my favorite videos that I've made so far. So I'm not completely done yet, but I'm getting pretty close. Like I said, my physics final is on Monday, but it's, it goes till like 10.30 p.m. And then as soon as it gets done, I get back, grab all my stuff, and hop on a train at the uh, at Union Station at 12.50. And then I don't, I don't get back to D.C. till like 6 a.m. in the morning. But it'll be nice to be back home to celebrate the holidays with my family. In terms of future content, uh, there was a lot of shenanigans that went on this week while we were uh, attempting to uh, study. So uh, I plan on compiling all of those into more of like a vlog style video. And that should be coming out um, as soon as I get home and start editing all the footage. <laughs> Trust me, there's a lot. And it's going to be a pretty good video, so uh, watch out for that. Then also, later today, I'm going to try to interview some more of my sweet mates. I know you guys like those videos. And there's a lot of cool people just living on this floor. And I, I know they'd love to share their opinions and advice with you, especially when it comes to Yale and the college application process in general. So look out for more sweet mate interviews coming in the uh, next couple weeks. And that's about it. Uh, anyways, uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the update. Um, if you did, make sure to hit the like button. It helps a lot more than you think. If you're new and you haven't subscribed yet, what are you doing? Just, just do it. We're about to hit 10K. We're so close. If you have any questions or anything, uh, ask away in the comment section below. 
and hopefully I'll be back again in a couple days with another video. See you soon.